unmanned vehicles have been in use for decades. The digital revolution has increased their abilities so greatly, especially in the smaller variants, that their use is now critical across the battle space. One element has not changed significantly, propulsion. Someone commented that our habit has been to strap wings on any available engine and call it a UAV. The result is limited performance and terrible reliability. One military UAV already in service requires several spare engines to keep a single bird flying. With private funding, UAV Turbines Inc. has already prototyped a family of high-performance, highly reliable turboprop engines specifically for UAVs. The prototypes range from a 10-pound, 5-horsepower unit to a 150-horsepower unit with a 200-horsepower engine in design. The 50-horsepower class UAVT Turboprop 1 is now in ground and flight testing in the airframe of a well-known UAV. The UAVT engine is designed to run 10 times as long between overhauls as reciprocating engines now in service. Less than 2 feet long, at less than 70 pounds, the Turboprop 1 packs significant power, more than enough for a wide range of Group 3 UAVs. Without the explosive sounds of a reciprocating engine, this UAVT turboprop is about as quiet as people in conversation far overhead. You just don't hear this coming. This engine uses a range of safe fuels commonly found in the battle space, not volatile aviation gasoline. The engine can be refueled even while still hot. When commercial jet aircraft came into service, passengers were encouraged to stand a nickel on edge during flight and you could almost do it. The smooth turboprop engine does not roughly shake itself and its payload. There's no need to maintain a stable of backup engines for each aircraft. Fuel efficiency is as good or better than that of reciprocating engines, and routine maintenance is simple. A single touch of a button starts the engine on the ground without extra equipment, or a signal restarts the engine in flight. Plenty of power for servo motors, instruments, and communication is produced by an integrated generator. Ironically, current UAVs can't fly from base to base domestically, but must be shipped by truck. The Turboprop 1 is designed for FAA certification to fly through civilian airspace from one base to another. These are revolutionary capabilities, sharply increasing effectiveness while reducing the cost of UAV operation. The revolution is made possible by technical synergy. These are fully integrated systems using newly engineered technology. The intake sucks in air, filters it, and feeds it to the compressor. The combustor burns the compressed air-fuel mixture at very high temperature, turning the turbine at high RPM and converting energy in the expanding gases to shaft power to drive the compressor and generator, but with most power going to the prop. The gearbox reduces the very high speed of the turbine shaft to a speed usable by the propeller, which is a variable pitch prop designed by UAVT for operation in dusty, sandy conditions while optimizing performance and efficiency. A specially designed heat exchanger recovers heat energy from the exhaust like a car heater using waste engine heat and recycles it to preheat air entering the combustor, increasing fuel efficiency. An intelligent control system uses input from sensors to govern starting, warm-up, and in-flight adjustments so the remote pilot can concentrate on the mission instead of on managing the engine. Those with battlefield experience will understand the practical impact of this in the battle space. To start with, the vehicle will be available, not down half the time, for engine repair, and the ease of operation means you can put it on station faster. With more power, control of engine performance, and low fuel consumption, the vehicle can stay where you need it longer. Being very quiet, not going bang, 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 is a major advantage. Further, instruments are more stable without the heavy vibration. The engine can be started and restarted at significant altitude, using easy-to-handle jet or diesel fuel or whatever is available. Instead of volatile aviation gas, vehicles can be refueled and back in service rapidly. Field maintenance is straightforward. There are only two filters to change, and all engines in the UAVT turboprop family are essentially the same. If you've worked with one, you've worked with all. Past problems have made commanders hesitant to rely on their UAVs. 
Increased confidence in these tools will let them try new tactics, changing the way UAVs are used. This really is a family of engines, each for a different class of vehicles, and yes, it's possible to go smaller as well as somewhat larger with the same technology. Of course, powerful small engines have other uses, and UAVT has constructed an engine in a box demonstrating their use as turbo generators. However, primary focus has been on propulsion for mid-range Group 3 UAVs. The EIB also demonstrates the ease of operation of the system. Just one touch of the start button puts the unit automatically through the multi-step process of starting and bringing the engine up to speed. UAV Turbines Inc. has built and tested all prototypes in its own facilities, but a highly respected major company will do the production manufacturing in the United States. The UAVT Turboprop 1 will be the first of the family of engines to enter service. UAV Turbines Inc. can be reached most easily at info at uavturbines.com.